Hey guys, I wanted to come on here and share some encouragement this weekend. Um, earlier, I was praying. I was, because um, I just read a devotional about gazing upon his face, gazing upon the, the face of Jesus and what it means to seek his face. Um, so I was just praying for for me to, to really see his face. I wanted to see it because I've, I've seen it before, although it was really bright. Um, and it was hard to make out, but I just, I just wanted to see it. And, um, I got quiet and waited and I didn't see anything. And then, um, I closed my eyes and, and I was picturing him, but I was also getting a little frustrated because I didn't just want to picture him. I wanted to see him. Um, and then I ended up reaching for my Bible and, um, you know, do my thing where I just open up, um, and I don't know where I'm opening up to. And I opened up to Hebrews chapter 11 and verse one just jumped off the page. It says, trusting is being confident of what we hope for, convinced about things we do not see. I'll just read that again. Trusting is being confident of what we hope for, being convinced about things we do not see. And it was just as if like he was speaking. It was it was so loud. It was so just encouraging. It was as if he was just answering me um, directly. That even if you don't see me, I'm there. Trust me. Be confident in me. Um, because yeah, Jesus never leaves us nor for, forsakes us. Um, and then I also just kind of want to speak into what's going on right now. Um, and just encourage the believers. Um, however, so I'm going to back up to one verse where it's Hebrews chapter 10, verse 39. However, we are not the kind who shrink back and are destroyed. On the contrary, we keep trusting and thus preserve our lives. Um, so with everything going on right now, the coronavirus, this crazy pandemic, worldwide pandemic, um, I just want to encourage my brothers and sisters to not shrink back in fear because according to the word, whoever shrinks back in fear will be destroyed. On the contrary, we keep trusting and thus preserve our lives. So if we want to preserve our lives, well, he's our preserver, trusting that he's our preserver and having that confidence in him um, that he will protect us. And... Um, just trying to think if there's anything else. Yeah. He does not give us the spirit of fear, but of love, power, and a sound mind. Um, so just stand firm and trust him. All right. Have a good rest of your weekend.